Hi, welcome back to PC Builder. I'm Jason. Black Friday and Cyber Monday in 2023 are finally here. Buckle up because this video is going to be a roller coaster ride through all the best deals for Black Friday 2023 and Cyber Monday 2023 on gaming monitors, gaming laptops, gaming pre built, and PC components like CPUs, GPUs, and so much more. Everything is linked down in the video description, so check those out, which will keep updated throughout the holiday shopping season as new deals come up. Of course, we all know that the best deals never get advertised. They just pop up suddenly. So check us out at PC Builder Jason on Twitter or our YouTube community page where we'll continually post deals throughout the holiday season. With that, let's jump into it. Before that, this video is sponsored by VIP SCD Key. Say goodbye to crazy expensive Windows 10 licenses and that terrible activate Windows 10 watermark. Right now, use the links in the video description, head over to VIP SCD Key, and get a Windows 10 Home or Pro OEM license for a great price. Pick your product license, then use the PC Builder discount code PC25 for an additional 25% off. Go to the activation settings on your PC, put in the code, and boom, you have a fully licensed Windows 10 for a crazy low price, which can be upgraded for free to Windows 11. Use the links in the video description below. Let's jump into the best gaming monitor deals for Black Friday and Cyber Monday in 2023. It's gonna quickly go through, starting at 1080p budget and working our way to the top. If you want all the normal educational stuff that we do, I'll leave it linked down in the video description. Our best game Gaming Monitor 2023 buying guide takes you through all of that. And remember, all these products are linked down in the video description. We're gonna keep changing those out over the holiday shopping period as stuff sells out and new stuff goes on deals. Starting off at the budget level, if you've got about $100, what should you be getting? You're probably gonna grab a 1080p gaming monitor, but you want a high refresh rate gaming one and a phenomenal deal right now over at Newegg is the AOC 24G2 SP E. The E just means that the stand's not adjustable, unfortunately. Still a phenomenal gaming monitor though. $99 is insane. This gaming monitor just in January was selling for $200, $220. $99 is amazing. This is a phenomenal panel. It's IPS, it's flat, great response times. Overall, this has been our top recommendation for quite some time for 1080p, and $99 is just insane. Another deal to keep your eye on is the AOC C24G1A 24-inch. It's a curved VA panel. Good motion handling on this monitor overall. Fully adjustable stand too, so if you don't wanna futz around with getting a different stand for the other one, maybe you just pick this one up instead. FreeSync Premium, overall really, really nice 1080p gaming monitor for just 120. Let's jump over 1440p gaming because I think this is where most of you wanna be, 1440p or 4K. And let's start off with a phenomenal value, the Acer Nitro. Now this is the XV271U. There's another variant, the XV272U that also may be swapped in and out because this one might sell out. At a $179. This level of mid-range 1440p gaming performance had only been available around the $299 to up to $300 price point at the beginning of the year. So seeing a price like this at $179 is pretty insane. 180 hertz refresh rate on it. This is my like automatic pickup. If you're looking for mid-range 1440p gaming monitors, this is the one to get. Jumping over to 1440p 240 hertz monitors. So those esports nuts out there go wild because look at this, $299. I did not expect to see this price point for 240 hertz 1440p this year. I, I was hoping maybe next year, but it's here, 299. This is the HP Omen. 27 QS, this is phenomenal motion handling. It's flat, it's IPS. Overall, just hands down, amazing gaming monitor. Now there's a couple different models here. There's a, a, an MSI one, there's the Gigabyte M27Q-X that I had recommended for a long time. Those have not hit this similar price point and they all perform almost identically. So my, my advice to you, just get the cheapest among them. And right now the Omen is absolutely killing it with this price. Let's jump over to a 4K, 144 Hertz, about 100. 80 hertz monitors, and these are LCD LED ones. These are not OLED. We'll go to OLED in just a moment. Here's an insane deal. The MSI Mag 274 UPF, $379. What? This was introduced just a couple months ago, just a couple months ago for like $700 and it's already $379. Now this is among a crop of really solid kind of budget to mid range 4K, 144 hertz ish monitors out there that includes like the Gigabyte M28U you're probably familiar with. There's a, an Acer Predator model that we continue to recommend. Still have not seen big discounts on those monitors, especially not to $379. And then there's of course the Samsung G7 4K version as well, still selling up in the 600s. 379 is a phenomenal price for this monitor. It's got HDMI 2.1 on it. So all of you console folks out there are completely taking care of this one. This is, I would just instantly snap this up. 
Jumping over to OLED gaming monitor deals for Black Friday and Cyber Monday, and I hope this deal is still around because this is insane. This is the Samsung Odyssey OLED G9, not the regular G9. This is an OLED panel, insane HDR. It's gonna have instantaneous response time. It's gonna have like infinite contrast ratio, just all the amazing goodness of OLED slammed into this. This is 1440p, 240 hertz, and basically it's like taking two 27 inch 1440p OLED gaming monitors, slamming them together and removing the bezel in the middle. It's absolutely insane. And look at $9.99. This thing was selling for around $1,600 just a couple months ago. So I would snap this up if the deal is still there and you got the desk space for it. If you're looking for a regular sized OLED gaming monitor, right now I would pull the trigger on the LG Ultra Gear. There's basically two models that kind of compete. There's the ASUS model and then there's the LG. The ASUS, I would say is very slightly better. You probably wouldn't even notice, but it's $200 more. I wouldn't spend $200 for very slightly better. The LG is insanely good. $778 right now over at Amazon. Again, 240 hertz, 1440p, G-Sync compatible. It's got AMD FreeSync Premium on it. Just snap this one up if this is within what you've been looking for. I don't think these monitors are gonna get much cheaper in 2023. If you're more on the console side of things, you just need 120 hertz, so extra refresh rate's not gonna help you. Look at the LG Ultra Gear 48 inch OLED 120 hertz, it's basically the same as like the LG C2 and C3 OLED TVs, only it's only $699 right now for 48 inches. This is great for a game room. They also have a 42 inch LG C3 OLED, I'll leave a link down in the description, for about $800. Another great option, especially if you want all the TV functionality, but if you don't need all that and you're just looking for something for your console, this is a great deal. Let's some of the best gaming laptop deals for Black Friday and Cyber Monday in 2023. Two cautionary notes when you're buying a gaming laptop in 2023. Number one, you need at least 16 gigs of system RAM. System RAM for that, don't buy an eight gig laptop, you're gonna regret it. Will massively hurt your FPS. The second thing is I would only buy an RTX 4060 or higher GPU. Do not get the 4050. It only has six gigabytes of video RAM on the card itself. You don't want that in 2023. And you can get insane deals. Look at this deal right here. This is the ASUS Tough Gaming i7 12700H, 16 gigs of RAM with an RTX 4070 and a one terabyte SSD for a thousand bucks. What is going on? These are like 14, 15, $1,700 laptops. I will say with the i7 12700H, you might find yourself slightly CPU bound in really CPU intensive titles, but honestly, thousand bucks, I would grab this in a heartbeat because you can't find anything else with this value. Of course, I don't expect that deal to be around forever. So this is generally what you're finding in terms of deals. This is the Acer Nitro 17. This has a Ryzen 7 7840HS, super high performance Ryzen CPU, especially in gaming, and the RTX 4060. Now it's a 4060, but it does come with one terabyte Gen 4 SSD, and it's a QHD screen, which just means it's basically 1440p, 165 hertz. $999. This is a really insane price for this, especially since these laptops were significantly more expensive only about a month ago. Another one to check out is the MSI Katana 15, especially if you want the 13th gen CPU or Ryzen 7000 series CPU with that RTX 4070 for $1,199. So $200 more than that super deal, which probably will sell out at some point. You can get the MSI Katana 15, RTX 4070, 13th gen i7 CPU, 16 gigs of RAM, one terabyte NVMe, Overall insane value, this is super highly rated as well. Let's jump with the best pre-built gaming PC deals for Black Friday and Cyber Monday in 2023. The big challenge with buying a pre-built this year is don't buy an RTX 4060 eight gigabyte or an RTX 4060 Ti eight gigabyte equipped machines. They do not have enough VRAM in 2023. I'd rather see you get an older 3060 instead or jump up to a 4070 or higher. Let's punch you three amazing deals right now. Remember everything's linked down in the video description. If I find some more deals, I'll throw them in there. Skytech Gaming Blaze 3.0, I don't, this is what they call the name of the case, $799. Here's the important stuff. i5-12400, great mid-range to budget CPU, and an RTX 3060 12 gigabyte card, 500 gigabyte SSD, a little smaller, but you, storage is so cheap, you can always add more. And it's got 16 gigs of DDR4-3200 memory. Remember, you don't want eight gigs, you want two sticks of memory. This is an insane value for only $800. Jumping up in terms of GPU power, we've got an RTX 4070 equipped PC for $1,299. Now these have been going for quite a bit more, so this is a great deal. This is the SkyTech Azure Gaming PC. Now this is over at Newegg right now. They also sell their PCs at Amazon as well. This has an RTX 4070 with the i5-13400F. 
one terabyte NVMe and 32 gigs of DDR5 RAM. I love 32 gigs of RAM for $12.99. Totally insane value right now. And it comes in that amazing looking SkyTech or that Montech Air 2 case. Another good deal right now is ABS. ABS is Newegg's in-house brand, really good quality. This is the Stratos, that's what they call anything that they put in this case, which is a thermal take case. The Aqua Performance, that just means it's got a 240 millimeter all-in-one liquid cooler. i7 13700KF, super high performance, RTX 4070 Ti, and it's got 16 gigs of DDR5. I wish I had the 32 gigs. 16 gigs is absolutely fine for gaming though, remember that. It's fine for gaming and streaming at the same time. $1,800, these PCs have been more like $2,000 plus dollars, so it's nice to see one under $1,800. Let's jump in the best GPU deals for Black Friday and Cyber Monday, June 2023, and we're not gonna recreate our whole GPU market update video, which we do every month. I'll leave it linked down in the video description. We go through every single card. Let's just go through the current deals right now. And all I'm gonna say is I expect better deals, better deals to continue to come starting, especially on Black Friday and through Cyber Monday. But right now, if you want something at the budget level, the RX 6600 eight gigabyte, there's a ton of different models. Although I do expect possibly these to completely sell through over the holiday season. I don't know if they're gonna come back or not. We'll have to see. AMD, I believe, is not producing these anymore. They want you to buy the 7600, not the 6600. These are about as strong, actually slightly stronger than like a 2070 Super, if you wanna kind of compare to an older generation GPU. And for about $185 to $189, you get day one driver support. They're better than the Intel GPUs. They're only a couple bucks less right now, so I would go with this. If you have to have NVIDIA, or if you have a little bit more money to spend, we wanna get to 12 gigs of VRAM, or at least 10 gigs of VRAM, as quickly as we can, because there's games coming out right now, AAA titles, that will require more than eight gigabytes of VRAM in 2023 to play at higher ultra settings, even at 1080p. So I like the RTX 3060 12 gigabyte. The MSI Ventus model right now is at 249. There was a Zotac at 249. It looks like it's completely sold through right now. I wouldn't wait to pull the trigger too long on these GPUs if you really want one. Kind of moving up on the ladder, honestly, this is probably my preferred one, even over the 3060, the RX 6700 XT. There's a couple different models. They keep one at 299. That may be as low as it goes. That's as low as it's been on Prime Day previously. I haven't seen one cut below that right now. Maybe they would even be taking a loss. But you see a whole lot around 309. It looks like every time this one of them at 299 sells out, they drop another one to 299. So this is where I would look. This is a high performance 1440p GPU. This will absolutely crush anything that we've already talked about right now. And again, 299. If you have a little bit more money, might make sense to move up to an RX 6800. You get 16 gigs of VRAM and you get significantly more performance. This is only 10% slower than the RTX 4070 and the 4070 sells for a lot more money. And AMD wants to completely liquidate these 6800 non-XTs and 6800 XTs as well. So I would look to pick one up for a 369. There's a high quality MSI model for about $20 more. Again, I'll leave it linked in the video description. RTX 4070, I don't think these cards are gonna get much cheaper right now. You could potentially wait for the 4070 Super in 2024, who knows when that's gonna come. If you don't wanna wait and for not that much more performance, look at getting something like the Zotac uh, Twin Edge one. $515 is as cheap as this has been. This is a good quality card too. Not really a lot of 6800 XT deals or 7800 XT deals to show you right now. So oh, check those links down in the video description for that. But let's jump up to the 7900 XT. Now this until this morning had been at $709. Makes me think like the ASRock Phantom Gaming, possibly Sapphire Pulse, we'll see that price again. Remember this got all the way down to $699 during Amazon Prime Day. So those are the prices I would look to hit it, and I will leave links in the video description. Honestly, if you get one at $709 instead of $699, I wouldn't sweat it. Just get the model that you want to get. And finally, for the 7900 XTX, right now $909. That is skirting the lowest price of the entire year for this card. Now, that's the ASRock Phantom Gaming model. You can pick up the Sapphire Pulse one for only $10 more. Maybe slightly higher quality card. They're both really, really good to be quite honest with you. You can just take your pick of the litter. I, it's possible these cards will get down into the high 800s, but I wouldn't hold out for like 850 or anything insane. Let's jump into CPU and motherboard combos because there's been huge, 
huge CPU discounts, especially on the Intel side, which I gotta be honest, totally shocked me. Intel has not wanted to cut prices, but clearly we're seeing the handwriting on the wall. Everyone is going rising right now, so there's massively slashing prices. You might wanna consider the i5 12600KF for $140. That is insane value. And there's some great value motherboards, Z690 motherboards right now for as little as $100. You're gonna find this CPU over at Amazon primarily. Newegg has not yet lowered its price on these CPUs just yet. I'll leave links to them down in the video description, of course. The motherboard that I would target with this, remember, since we're building more of a budget-oriented gaming PC, we wanna go DDR4 because it's cheaper than DDR5, and I would go with something like the ASRock Z690 Phantom Gaming 4, $99. This has good enough VRMs to put an i5-13 600K on in the future if you want to, or 14600K, pretty good rear IO. It's got BIOS flashback on it. Overall, nice motherboard for $99. If you want something with upgraded audio, better VRMs, kind of overall better features, I do like the ASRock Z690 Extreme. Note that this is not on any kind of deal. It just sits here at $139. It's just one of the best value Z690 motherboards out there. It's got BIOS flashback. It's a lot of rear panel USB connections on it. Overall, I don't know why this motherboard just doesn't completely sell out. Another good size discount on the i5, 13600KF down to $250, much more competitive, especially if you need extra CPU horsepower for a lot of other non-gaming purposes and you want a game. This is a great setup that I would recommend. I love the i5 13600KF for $250 right now over at Amazon. Again, Newegg has not yet at the time of this video lowered their prices, but I'll include both links down in the video description so you can check it out. I love though the ASRock Z690 PG Velocita. This is a DDR5 motherboard with upgraded everything on it for only $157, though there are some other really good Z690 and even Z790 boards out there, but they're more like $199. So if you're looking to do something a little cheaper and still get all the premium features, absolutely love this motherboard. And then of course for the RAM, I would go DDR5 6000 CL30. Check out our best RAM for gaming 2023 video. This is the RAM that I would go with. You don't need to do anything fancy. $93 here for a 32 gigabyte kit. This has been the absolute value kit. It also comes in white if you want to do that instead. Of course, what I think everybody's been waiting for is huge deals on Ryzen 7000 and AMD has not disappointed. It's not disappointed here. Let's go through them. There's two different ones here that I think everyone's going to be interested in. The first is $199 Ryzen 7600. Let's start with that one right now. You can get that over at Newegg or at Amazon. The 7600X, 10 bucks more, you might consider that because I'm gonna recommend that you replace the stock cooler that comes with the 7600 anyway. Check out our 7600 build guide that we released just about a week or so ago down in the video description for more on motherboards, coolers, all that kind of stuff. But 199 or you can get it for 209 the 7600X. In terms of motherboards, you have a really wide selection and there's a lot of motherboard deals out there right now. Something as cheap as the Gigabyte B650 MDS3H is fine for this. Absolutely fine for a Ryzen. 7600 build. Remember, you want at least an RX 6700 XT 12 gigabyte GPU or like an RTX 4060 Ti 16 gigabyte GPU or higher for these. Otherwise, go with more, the more budget oriented CPUs. And the board that I really love with this, for the 7600, frankly, for the 7800 X3D, if you want to save some money, is the ASRock B650M Pro RS Wi Fi. We use this in our live stream build that we did. This motherboard is phenomenal. It's got three M.2s on it. It's got plenty of rear panel connectivity for gaming, uh, for gaming on there. And it's got Wi-Fi Bluetooth for $125. Totally insane value. Of course, the RAM I'm gonna recommend for Ryzen 7000 across Across the board is DDR5 6000 CL30, this team group kit that we already went through for the Intel deals, also amazing for that. So $92 over at Amazon and at Newegg. All right, jumping back to the Ryzen 7800X 3D, it's down to 359. Will it get cheaper? It might get cheaper. It went down to 349 for Amazon Prime Day, but Intel released 14th gen and it kind of fell flat on its face. So I think AMD feels like it can get away with a higher price for the 7800X 3D, which de facto is the fastest gaming CPU out there right now. Yeah, you can get a 4900K, but that's not a gaming CPU. It's like almost $600. Here it is right now over at Newegg. This is the cheapest you're gonna find it because they throw in an extra $10 promo code. If you wanna buy it on Amazon instead, you're gonna basically take a $10 penalty, but you can absolutely do that and I'll include both links down in the video description. Let's talk about some better motherboards, higher tier motherboards. Of course, those cheaper budget motherboards are fine with the 7800X 3D, but if you wanna invest a little bit more, get upgraded audio, 
audio, upgraded other features, get a full-size ATX board. Asus Tough Gaming right now for $199, $199. Now the Strix B650-A, which I really like, had been down to $199, right now it's not there. I will, if it comes back to that super good price, I'll of course include it down, linked in the video description, so check those out. But this is a great board to look at. Another great board right now is the MSI Mag Tomahawk B650. It comes with Wi-Fi on it, three M.2 slots. It's got fully upgraded ALC 4080 audio on it. It's got a ton of rear panel connectivity to it, BIOS flashback. $195 right now is a really good value for this. Let's jump through some NVMe SSD deals for Black Friday and Cyber Monday 2023. And I will say storage right now is stupidly cheap at the one terabyte and two terabyte level for like Gen 3 NVMe SSDs. If you just want something good for your system, you don't see a lot of quote unquote deals out there, but they're already so cheap. I don't really think we're gonna see huge discounts off those, but you can find discounts off the higher performance drive like the Samsung 990 Pro, two terabyte right now. So it's gen four and it has DRAM on it, $119. It's one of the fastest kind of prosumer level drives, or actually I would say professional level drives out there right now, $119. If you're just looking for tons of storage out there, four terabyte units seem to be on fire sale right now. This is the Team Group MP34, so another drive with DRAM. It's Gen 3, most users don't need Gen 4, especially Gen 5. This would be fine for most people out there, even if you're doing like video editing work because it's got DRAM on it. $152 right now for four terabytes. If you do want something slightly faster for Gen 4 and DRAM, the Acer Predator GM7000, four terabyte drives on for 185. So it's another 35 or so, $30 in order to get Gen 4. And this is well worth it. Let's jump through some great gaming setup deals for Black Friday and Cyber Monday in 2023. And honestly, I don't even know how they ship this mouse to you for this cheap. $11.99 for the G203 as a wired gaming mouse. If you're on a budget, you're looking for just something to kind of get you into gaming, I would pick this up. Now, the other colors, they're all a little bit more than $19.99, which is still a good deal, but this is insane at $11.99. If you're looking for a 60% keyboard, this is a great deal, the RK Royal Clutch. RK61 comes in white or comes in the black color that you see here. The great thing about this is you can actually pick your switches. They come in red, they come in blue and brown switches. You just select down here which switches you want as well as the color and they're all $39.99 for the 60% keyboard. If you're looking to kind of step up your game a little bit with your gaming mouse, the HyperX Pulsefire Haste 2, highly reviewed and highly rated gaming mouse out there, ultra lightweight, $39.99 over at Amazon. Speaking of Razer, a keyboard that I absolutely love, love Razer Huntsman V2. This is a 10 keyless, so it's still got all the delete and the other keys on it. I love 10 keyless stuff. And I was using this one exclusively. That is until friend of the channel, Jim, sent me a custom keyboard that I'm using just all the time. So thank you, Jim. But if you don't have a friend like Jim who's gonna send you a custom keyboard, this is an amazing value for $99. Remember, everything is linked down in the video description. So check out those links, which we will keep updated throughout the holiday shopping season. Check us out at PC Builder Jason on Twitter and our YouTube community page where we're gonna continue to drop deals throughout the holiday season. If you got value of the video, give it a like. It makes a huge difference to the channel, especially this right here and we'll catch you on the next one.